Mustaches are undoubtedly uh, overrated. I'm, I'm with Noel Gallagher on this one. It definitely means that you're, you're putting too much energy and, uh, and thought and life into uh, hair above your lip. The Great British Bake Off is totally overrated, overcooked, overhyped, over it. Any kind of technology, uh, sex becomes a kind of a function of it straight away. So it's just the, just the way we are. It's all about the sex and it, no matter what the technology. Morrissey, uh, enigma, ex-partner, words, politics. Love and hip hop. I don't understand why how those two are, are, are related, really. Actually, if I think about Kendrick Lamar, I think that's kind of underrated, really. Love and hip hop. Yeah, I'm just getting a nice warm feeling right now. I like that phrase. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep that with me all day. Love and hip hop. So, love and hip hop is a terrible reality television show. I really want to see that right now. Kendrick's not going to be on that show, right? No, 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 no. It sounds great. <laughs> Jazz, I'm gonna go there, people. Jazz is fucking awesome. McCoy Tyner, awesome. John Coltrane, awesome. Cannonball Alderley, off the scale. Miles Davis, obviously. Jazz revival starts here. Uh, okay, Bone China, totally, totally overrated. For some reason in the 1980s, the Smiths made our records, our albums in, um, in these old country houses, these residential studios. You got in there and it was just all bone china in there, like old cups and saucers from the family that I'd lived there before. So I have this association with these tiny little cups and trying to make a decent cup of tea there when I'm trying to make a fucking hit record. So, nah, nah. Just remind me of cold old country houses that are charging me a thousand pounds a day. Baseball, totally overrated. One time I sat on the couch with someone who was a big fan and got stoned and they explained it to me. It was fascinating, but I'm sure it was probably only five minutes went by and um, seemed like hours, <laughs> frankly. It's an interesting five minutes. Probably something to do with the weed. Uh, I'm not really involved with, with Red Bull because just because of the whole inference of uh, bovine testicles is not really my jam, shall we say. <laughs>